Good morning. Good morning. I'm trying to think of like a kid's morning song. I can't really think of one. I would love to sing you a jingle though. You guys ever watch Full House? They got a uh, Uncle Jesse, his like job is jingle making up, you know? Like uh literally a company just hires him, he sings a song. Rant over. I feel like we vlogged this other day and I was showing you my workout and stuff, but I feel like I haven't really like talked to you guys. I had Dan around and we were working out. But like I opened a gym. And we've been open for like nine months now. And I opened an apparel brand and I've been designing apparel cut and sew custom small batch apparel and i haven't been able to like talk to you so what's up you two what's poppin'? how you been doing how is 2020 how's 2021 my timeline's just been in a blender bro i don't know what day it is i don't know what year it is i don't care i've just been chipping away i think a lot of us look i'm lucky i'm a lucky dude i'm, I'm, I'm very lucky and my life's been good but the fitness industry wasn't so hot uh, with the pandemic. And we don't gotta get political. I don't really care what you think, to be honest, about what's going on in the world. But the truth is it affected all of us. So I'm sending my love to you that it did affect, whether it be financially or health-wise in your families. Um, it looks like there's some light at the end of the tunnel right now. And I've struggled uh, mentally sitting through this shit. Luckily, I've, I've had work to kind of take my mind off things, but truth is you got to go home and sit with yourself you got to go to bed sit with yourself and and sometimes it hasn't been very good for me um but i'm here man i'm here i'm alive uh let me show you guys around hopefully there's nothing i can't show you this is the office so we'll get to the gym and, and I, we did like a mini tour um, but i'll do like an official gym tour soon but this is the office right here fam um you come in we just kind of shout out to jim mcd my business partner and, and podcast co-host he uh he really set this room up i wish i could take advantage or, or take a, 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 a uh, what the hell is the word? It's still early, fam. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. But so we got kind of do all our shipping out of here. Um, me, Kyle, Jim, kind of do it all ourselves. We're kind of a three-man team, to be honest. Uh, just a little lounge. Uh, we'll probably build this out into a more casual podcast or YouTube set. But right now, you literally just kick it. Here's all leftover clothing. Um, everything is small batch. So like over there on that rack, there's like 2XL, 3XL, and extra small. Because like all the main sizes just kind of always sell out. That's like half on purpose, half not. I want to force myself to be creative. And so I want to create new items, new colorways, new cool things every single drop. I don't want just like to sell a black shirt with white script on it for the end of time just to make money. Trust money, me, money, I want money. to make money, but I want to really push the envelope and tell a story with each launch and have like a real theme to each, each, each drop we have. And so um, there's very few left over. Like this last PE one, it seemed like y'all really loved. Uh, I loved it too. And there's like three shirts left and four tanks. So we just don't have that much. We have three hoodies from last year um, in the works right now for our next drop. Uh, since you're all the fam, you, you get a little insight. It's called the staple drop. It's going to be super clean. Something you can wear out for sure. You can wear it in the gym, of course, but heavy duty kind of fall gear, uh, durable. Um, but, but kind of that athleisure that doesn't, doesn't scream, I lift barbells. It's real, real dumbed down. Um, so it's cool. Here's a podcast set. If y'all haven't been tuning into the show, we're dropping two different shows here um, weekly. It looks so good on camera. In person, it doesn't look that sick. It just looks messy, but on camera, it looks fucking sick. Um, and obviously, that's why Jim did it. 50% uh, Facts, the podcast. Drop that every Wednesday on all audios if you guys want to listen to me talk shit. Uh, we've been doing some movie reviews, documentary reviews, shit like that. Um, it's about 9 o'clock in the morning. I'm training. I normally train around noon or so. Uh, so I'm going to get to some of this pack. And we just got a few orders trickling in. 3SB.co if you want to get involved. Be sure to thumb this things up, man. I appreciate you guys so much. And I'll catch you later when we train. Uh, no pre-workout, man. Training fasted. Let's get jacked.
function of the biceps. So if we not only want elbow flexion, but we like pinky supination, now we're really get that beat going. summertime we were drenched true but you make me drenched whoa Gross. drop top horse rolling on my wrist diamonds all in my chain it's a good song dude all night long yeah so so tonight i'm gonna show you how when I'm walking with you, see the whole room change. See, that's what you do. Blend it on my car. You don't like Bruno? Oh, we love Bruno. I love Bruno. I love Bruno. The footwork. The footwork working for him. That's good, huh? You don't have to do anything with the footwork. Posting memes, dude. Give me a sec. Posting meme, memes. Your, your page is now a meme page. I'm just a fitness meme page. When we cry, it just pops off, you know? says anything isn't fun when I'm fucking around. Look at his yeah. smile. That guy's never smiled when he's doing cardio in his life. Look at him. It is true. It is cheesing true. like it's Christmas Eve. Mama, what are cookies? It is true. Is Santa Claus coming? 